Hello, this is SimCity Brian. And this is Pablo from SimNation. Today we're going to test out the abilities of the glass box engine as for how it works in a multiplayer game. Yeah, it should be interesting uh, given that uh, uh, we've learned so much about commuting and we've been told so much about commuting by SimCity. We keep trying things but sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. So we're going to see if we can actually make two separate cities work as one. Yes, it's definitely going to be interesting, and if the glass box cannot handle commuting, uh, at least we'll be able to see what doesn't work and what does work. Yeah, in worst case scenario, like we mentioned before, we just show it to Maxis, dude, this doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs> uh, they just got to watch it. Yeah, they gotta, we're going to make them watch. <laughs> So I'm looking at my resources. Uh, I'm going to be the city that supplies more jobs. And hopefully the commuters coming from Pablo's uh, city will uh, pay off. Yeah. I'm looking at my resources. It's like, well, looking at a blank slate. <laughs> yeah, you, beautiful. Yeah, you so, have uh, Basically, okay. yeah, sorry. I didn't mention it. I'm in Iguana Flats. So it has like no resources, just a bunch of water. And I'm in uh, Rattlesnake Ridge, which has uh, uh, a balance resource, even water. Yeah. Oh, How is water in your uh, city? Water is fairly good, actually. It's like over 50% of the surface. Where is it? Yeah, it's a lot. So I should have plenty. We're going to be fine. Otherwise, we can just always process poop into water. <laughs> <laughs> and that'll give us... <laughs> that sounds so appetizing. Yeah. <laughs> as long as they don't mix the pipes it will be fine so um all right so well of course we both need uh residents that's a uh, given we can't really play without like residents in one of the other cities because uh it's like a currency basically how much population you have so that's a must really oh yeah uh, i mean so... i'll supply more industry and places for people to work um you know i'll definitely have residents uh, just like you will um, and I guess we'll both supply a little bit of uh, commercial, you know, as far as shopping. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I think uh, I wanted to go circular city, but uh, that's going to be expensive. I can't. So we're going to go semi-circle city. <laughs> 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 the poor people out there. <laughs> well, you, you could be able to uh, modify it later on. Oh, yeah. True. True that. True that. Um. Oh, well. What I'll do is kind of wrap my roads around um, the areas that have resources and then hopefully make kind of an interesting city as I go. Yeah, I just realized I can't do that, so I'm going to do something funky. <laughs> <laughs> I have to watch out. I want to make sure I can make good uh, population density, but... Because usually I do so many crazy things, then I can't really build anything high density because <laughs> the spaces are so tight. But uh, so I'm gonna watch out for that. And uh, yeah, so my my city uh, technically uh, won't be able to provide much much of uh, jobs, but um, we'll have a lot of comers, and we'll see if they commute to my city to buy things. Uh, may maybe you're probably gonna have to use more parts to make keep them happy as a fallback. Actually, that's uh, definitely a good idea with the parks. Yeah, uh, with the you know the right wealth and all because they're gonna. Oh, oh, where, oh I forgot about the wind. I, I'm gonna have to build some industry, right, or not? Do you think we can make? I'm, yeah. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna do anything. I'm not gonna put any industry. <laughs> I think you have to have. You'll have to have industry to begin with. Uh, sure. Until my city gets big enough to supply jobs, but later on you should be able to get buy with very little industry maybe none at all just depends on how the how the commuting works we'll see we'll see maybe 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 yeah i'll put it that is true hold on we're gonna make fancy roads because fancy is the word of the day <laughs> and uh oh there we go bye bye high density and this is gonna be all houses Hmm. Usually I start off with wind power, but I don't have a whole lot of wind over here. How's your wind on the, your side? That's a good question. Well, it should be bad also. Yeah. Oh, it's 11 miles per hour. That's, yeah, I got eight easy. miles an hour. Yeah. 
So to save each other money and plus to test out um, this engine, uh, what do you want to supply to begin with? Uh, water, sewage, or power? Um. <laughs> How about I start with water and sewage and you start with, uh, with power? That sounds like a fine idea, Brian. <laughs> you sound he like was... you weren't too sure about that. <laughs> no, okay, for, for those on your side, I was just placing a wind power plant as you were asking me that oh, question. Oh, okay. So that worked <laughs> out was, perfectly. That worked out, yeah, so I don't have to demolish it. Cause... <laughs> well, eventually, I mean, we'll both have to have, you know, some of the services, but we'll mooch off the other one, you know, part of the time. Yeah, totally. Just wonder how long it, you know, I got one water and sewage down right now it just depends on how fast it uh, takes before you could start buying from the other yeah uh well yeah see right now we're also this is an important thing we're going to be fighting a lot especially at this time against uh the synchronization frequency for the city uh, the region city in, in the region because i still see like you have 50,000 50, simoleons. I know people, maybe you haven't done anything yet, but I think you already spent your 50,000 at least a little bit. I've spent and half of see, it. Yeah, like I still see you're like full. And um, I'm going to visit you and see if that helps. Because it still tells me you have like no water to sell. Which Yeah, can, the same thing, with, same thing with power. I don't see any power from you. So I, at the beginning here, I went ahead and put down a power plant as well. You know, it's 8,000. You know, that's not that much. Yeah, that sounds that sounds fine. Let's see. Who wants to be the flats? Who wants to be the first one to put down city hall or town hall? Uh, we'll see who can make it, actually. <laughs> um, well, let's see. What do you have to? Oh, I got to provide working power. I still can get your water. Your water is far fetched. All right. So I think yeah, we're gonna have to self provide for now. Yeah. Like with minimum, and then we just actually I think I could be providing. I know I can provide better uh, power. Yeah, that is true. You know, when I put my power plant down, my wind picked up. It was going 15 miles an hour. Oh, there you go. All right, so city needs power. I know that. Just people won't want to work in it. That's that's the problem. <laughs> All right. So yeah, that's a weird curve I did here. By the way, I can't see it. <laughs> Good. I'm glad you can. We're going to make more fancy roads right now. Yeah. Do you start off with um, paved streets and avenues, or do you go with dirt roads to begin with? Um, I I never use the pavement desk or the, um, the dirt roads at all for some... Like, I know it's technically cheaper, because it is, but then I think they have to upgrade it. And uh, but wait, the cost for upgrading one of these is. Hold on. But should do be you about... pay? Do you pay the full price or just the difference? I think you pay the difference. You never, never really paid attention because if you go to upgrade, yeah, you you get a price, a total price for what that is. So I'm not really sure, but um... uh, let me see. I'm gonna do a quick test right here, so we'll find out. Uh, so I'm going to draw a medium. No, no, no. Yeah, you're totally paying the difference. Yeah, you're paying the difference. Wow. All right, so yeah, I guess that, that's a viable option. <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, using dirt roads. That's totally an option. That'll, that'll probably be a thing soon. All right. Yeah, I always use it just simply because it is a, a savings to begin with when early on you need money. Yeah, I agree. All right, guys, we're going to make a dirt city. <laughs> That's how it's going to work. Actually, the dirt roads look uh, appropriate in this area. Yeah, I, I do like uh, the look they give it to the city. Like, it's like, um, I like to use it like to cut uh between one road and, and another so you make like this short road of just small houses 
that looks nice. Oh, by the way, yeah, in, in this region, it looks interesting, the, the, the road. Even more sense than the other roads, which have grass, and it really impacts if you zoom in. They shouldn't have put grass there. <laughs> it looks weird. You know, I'm finding this uh, region is is very interesting to play um, because, you know, I, I like hilly terrain, but the maps are so small that the hilly terrain doesn't really work that well. But with this one, it's more, you know, there's flat and then plateaus, you know, to where you do have flat terrain to work with. Right. Yeah. Yeah. I, I've been playing some cities that had like so many hills you could barely build anywhere. <laughs> it was just terrible. Uh, it's good because it's challenging and all, but then you're like, oh, I really wish I could build something here. So yeah, I, I do like the, the aspect of this, this region. Indeed. All right, this, this is a weird looking, all right. <laughs> Oh, I forgot about my oil fields because I'd plan on drilling and I started building over top of them. Oh, no. But you know oh, what? I should check my oil fields too. Got known. Perfect. <laughs> Makes it easy for you, huh? <laughs> Super easy. Problem solved. No money underground. <laughs> but for now, I already have the road, so I'll leave them there because uh, I, I just won't zone around it and build around it. And I think I'll be fine. But I am not, here at the beginning until we get more population. I do have to zone more. Oh, by the way, uh, I can use your switch now if you want. Okay. Yeah? All right, I'll do that. So you're taking care of switch and water? water? Yes. And right. I'll add more to it uh, here in just a few minutes. I'm going ahead and drop in City Hall. As soon as oh, I, find I see a you're way. using some power now for me. Oh, cool. Yeah. Say, oh no no so no no that that's sorry wrong wrong tab wrong tab guys all right I know I can buy from you power but uh, it should be the other way around well I just uh, click buy in power from you so uh, uh, I won't add any more to my power right. so I can get yours cool all right well here's the population of one of lads place with nothing. All they got is a lazy llama lunch hand <laughs> and a, taco, a bunch of taquerias. What's going on here? It's just a road of, this is going to be the taco street right here, guys. It's all taquerias. <laughs> what is going on? Yep. Shoot, I keep on wasting money on a road trying to place my city hall exactly where I want, but it's too close to the edge and I got to keep on bulldozing the road and moving it back. Ah, mm. third time's you a charm. Need? A measuring tool. No, you need a packet of, yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you need a bunch of them. Um... All right, this is looking weird. Well, it's going to make sense whenever I keep building my avenues somewhere else. Meanwhile, it's going to look weird. But for a good cause. For the kids. It's for the kids. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> um uh yeah so uh unemployment crisis all right so here's the the first <laughs> thing we can <laughs> conclude uh the guy who hates uh hates you and says uh not enough free producers now is telling me unemployment crisis there are more workers than there are jobs so an industrial or commercial to add more workplaces well you know what i'll give you so much commercial you'll throw up a commercial <laughs> that's what's going to happen you well, like, oh my God, so many commerces in this city. Well, currently I have 10 of your low wealth commuting into my city for uh, jobs. I oh, have, yeah. uh, I only, and I have 10 other available jobs, but I'll increase that um, for low wealth. But I have 132 available jobs for medium wealth and eight for high wealth. So let's create some more industry. That is cool. So already starting to, oh, let me go back to that uh, screen again and see if, if I have any commuting out. No, I do not. Let's build some more industry. 
You live here? Well, we're going to put a Starbucks here, so you better go away. We need more commerce. Oh, thinking of Starbucks? Do you have any mods? <laughs> Not yet. Not yet. I got. I took Opie's uh, uh, McDonald's mod. So whenever I have, what is it, uh, a commercial, um, medium wealth, uh, low density, uh, McDonald's can pop up. What? They're testing uh, mods? Um, yes. Yeah, cool. That is cool. Yeah. I, I don't know how I feel about having my whole city. It's just Starbucks everywhere. <laughs> what will happen with the taquerias? I mean, come on, guys. Think about it. Uh, <laughs> right, so we are over a thousand people here. I think it's time for a town hall. Um, where do I want this town hall? Mm, this looks like a fine spot. I have mine overlooking a cliff, but you don't have that uh, advantage. Now, this is the nothing city. The town hall is aiming towards nothing. <laughs> Just <laughs> nothing at all. All right, they fixed the, the, the arrow that would insist you to change the city name until you actually did it. Now it just blinks a little bit. That is good. And I, I don't like that it says, this mayor came to your city when he didn't. I like to add Maxis. Maxis. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, sir, what do you need? Mayor Pablo Nato, this is a great town, but I need a place to work. Yeah, well, you can commute. That's, yeah, that's tell the him, thing. Tell them to come to uh, Rattlesnake Ridge. That is right. They got jobs for you. <laughs> they are going to make the goods that are going to be sold in these commerces. So that's what up. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I see, yeah, I see 21 low wealth commuting out. Well, that's the only wealth I got. So that is, that is good. And um, yeah, I'm, I'm going to have to keep my taxes in place because they'll, they'll get unhappy really quickly. <laughs> Dude, I can work and you raise the taxes. What up? So what do you usually what? set your taxes at? Uh, I guess uh, if I really need it, I can take the low wealth to up to 11%. Um, oh, I, I think the threshold, my, yeah. I set mine at 12% and usually leave it for low wealth. Yeah. Um, I'm a mean, right now, yeah, yeah, mean, mean mayor. Mean mayor. Yeah, actually, I think I can push it there. They seem to be too happy. I can capitalize on that. <laughs> they seem to be 77% approval rating. Yeah, I can, I can capitalize on that. They don't need to be that happy and I can steal my more money. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, there was a same saying, you know, when you hover under balloons, one said, money goes up, happiness goes in. <laughs> like, yep, that's not shallow at all. <laughs> That's that's the game mechanic right there. Explain in a nutshell. Um, anyway, um, let's see. So we seem to need like even more in commerces. Now my question is, commerces. Do you need? Uh, no, where is it? Do you need like not enough shoppers? And we could use some freight shipments. I agree. So how's that tree, trade debug going on? Can you export goods already? <laughs> you know, trade, you know, I guess I need to add that. And, you know, we probably need to add mass transit like uh, a bus depot, even though you have 46 commuting in uh, to my city for uh, 775 or 85 total jobs. We don't have any mass yeah. transit. Yeah, that's going to help a lot if we have like a, at least a bus terminal. So we need a town hall to be upgraded to a city hall in the region and a department of transportation in the region. So as soon as I upgrade, I could add that. Oh, you upgraded. Oh, you already have? No, I got like oh, a okay. thousand people. Yeah, I got 1,500. I was like, that was quick. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and I'm, yeah, 1,700, almost 2,000. Well, we're going to make it in there eventually. Uh, they're just struggling with happiness. And I'm pressing all the keys except the one I want. Where, where is? 
building density map. There we go. All right. So then they'll they'll grow soon. Oh yeah. Guys, it's time for more avenues by your crazy mayor. Mayor that does crazy avenues that are unneeded. He'll do it just to make you happy. <laughs> Keep voting for me. Like if you had a choice, and that is our slogan. Yeah, isn't it a dictatorship here? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I never knew that. That, that. That was funny. Also, you can you can stay here like two, I don't know, 200 years, and no one will question your survival <laughs> for, <laughs> for what is like the most longest human ever lived. <laughs> what? All right, yeah. Um, so, Ooh, um, I forgot about the clinics and health. <laughs> What, they need that? Yeah, it does. <laughs> it is requirement. Oh, all right. And if you wait too long, it uh, you spend more money on uh, extra ambulance bays and patient rooms. Yeah, trying to fix the, yeah. Look at crime. crime well, we got fine. crime? Well, I don't have any yet, thankfully, because I don't like to spend any money until I really have to. Yeah, no, I know. I wouldn't place any of these until I really have to. No crime, one death, oh well, and no fire. Like, pff, we're fine. Like, seriously, where do you get... You, okay, somebody died. I see the map, there's no germs. Just one dead, pe pe one dead person. That's <laughs> it. That's probably, like, natural selection. He had to die because he was too stupid to survive a city with no germs. Uh, so I guess we shouldn't worry about it that much. Uh, that will be fine. Uh, okay, now that I look my safe from the top, it looks like a germ. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> now, what, now what, what overlay are you looking at? Uh, the health map? Oh, yeah, I was looking at the health map, by the way. Yeah. Okay. Oh, wow, I, mean, I got... The roads make it look like a germ. I don't know. Oh, I got you. I'll have to wait and see your video. Oh, yeah? <laughs> yeah, I have six people that died. Well, actually, it says six per day, but I show seven. Well, maybe that's not an X. Maybe that's uh, something else. Oh, my God. Uh -oh. This is going to be the most beautiful circle ever. Yeah, what? Sorry, what? I heard you say, oh, my God. I was like, uh-oh. Oh, no, no, no. That's a good, oh, my God. That's a beautiful circle right here. <laughs> Sorry, I won't play in SimCity. Okay, yeah, I'll get to it. Uh so I'm going to put down my first or mine. That should provide jobs as well. Hey, yeah, we need those. I keep, I keep using the SimCity 4 keys once in a while, the hard keys. That's been over 10 years since I played it, so uh, I can't remember keys. Uh, I, it used to be really comfortable to go QWA for like residents and so on. I wish I could still do that. You can't really change the shortcuts here. Well, you couldn't there either, but oh well. Point is, point is, point is, we need more tankadias. Donuts? <laughs> no, who's it donuts? We need more tankadias. I'm waiting for my McDonald's to pop up somewhere. Although I'd prefer maybe a Wendy's or uh, even a Hooters. Not not so much for uh, the food that Hooters makes, but uh, for the Hooters. They said the service is interesting, right? Yes, exactly. Serving is is a thing there, yeah. Questionable. Hmm. But if it's for the food, for a burger, I would prefer to have a sloppy cow, which is a local so joint uh, in my neighborhood, or D.D. Peckers, which is uh, um, maybe a 15-minute drive from my house. Which Dee Dee Peckers uh, have chicken wings. Oh, you know, when I was in the U.S., I, I tried two chicken wings. One was from Kentucky Fried Chicken. That was very good. And then I had something that I, that I called, let's do something to say I was in the U.S. So I bought uh, chicken, whatever it was. I don't even know if it was chicken. It was fried, definitely, at a gas station. 
and <laughs> it looked like a brand. So I was like, well, it shouldn't kill me because it seems like they would have lawyers or something. So <laughs> it, it shouldn't kill me right away. And um, that was the most greasy thing I ever ate. And I said, yeah, I've been to the U.S. now. <laughs> that is all. <laughs> The Kentucky Fried Chicken one was great, by the way. That was spicy and all. That. I liked it. Well, as far as a chain goes, um, I'd, I'd have to say Bojangles is better than Kentucky Fried Chicken. Oh, yeah. I never heard of it. Um, and the roads are still glitching. Well, yeah, I guess they didn't release any patch, do they? Um, is that where the dirt kind of shows over the road? Yeah, and also roads and all. Just weird. I made even a whole video of all bugs on the last update slash the new regions. I don't know what what is it coming from, but it, it, there are many bugs. Selling water to SimCity Brian. Why? How? Why? Why am I selling you water? Oh, simply because I gotta add another water tower. <laughs> oh, I mean, I can I can totally provide for you, but. Oh, no. Uh, I, whenever I play in a multiplayer region, I go to the region view and automatically select buy, buy yeah. from everybody, you know, because it's a backup. You know, just like you just now told me that I was buying water from you. That was an indication, hey, I need to add more water. Right. But you don't necessarily run out of water. That, that's so correct. That is good. Well, uh, you know, I'm going to expand my, uh, my wind power plant. 15 miles per hour right now. That's awesome. So you can just buy from here and that'll be fine. Uh, look at this. It's like a, it's like an electronic circuit, guys. Look at this. I love the sound of buildings just getting plugged in after a, a sharp coming in power. Just, oh, I love the, the sound. It's beautiful. Let's see if uh, there, there are noises in this region. Like on the tropical one. Now this is more like everything's dead. That could be the city name. Everything's dead. Um. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot to add um, storage lot for my or ore, so nothing was being exported. That's not good. Oh well, you have three trade depot. Yes, I have one uh, with uh, three storage Ooh. lots for freight, and then now one with ore. And then when I gain a little bit more money, then I'll add another one for uh, just a whole depot just for ore, for exporting. So I can make money. Oh, okay. Nothing that has low wealth goods to sell. Use the region wall to ask your neighbors to zone more residential. Really? Wait. Wait. What? Oh, nothingness is my city. Sorry, I changed my name. Oh. <laughs> uh, nothingness. Because I said there's nothing here. Um, yes, I don't have... Okay, no. What it's telling me is that I need more tourists. All right, yeah, I, I, I feel you. All right, how about? Oh, wait. You're sending me freight. We're seeing this right here. You should totally go to a uh, region view and show this to everybody. If you go to freight, the fourth button or the third after. Ah, uh, I got yeah. 688 commuting out. What do you see on yours? On commuters? Um, uh, industrial freight. I got oh, 688 yeah. commuting out. Do you have the same 688. number commuting in? 688. I got 644. Well, it's that's pretty much the same. Close enough. Yeah. You know, maybe the other 44 is in transit. It's already left my city. It just hasn't arrived in your city yet. Yeah, it's pretty accurate. It's pretty accurate, yeah. It's quite up to date. The synchronization is quite up to date, yeah. All right, now, so this is interesting. How about workers? I have a total of 1,000 jobs uh, and only 15 commuters coming mm -hmm. into the city. How many do you show? This is really, this is really exciting, by the way. All right, so <laughs> actually, it is. You know, it's very it interesting because really whenever I've tested something like this, it's been by myself. Yeah, no, this is really cool. All right, so um, I got a thousand Lowell jobs. How many do you have commuting here? Uh, only fifteen. Fifteen. I got. I have six hundred eighty-seven available in low wealth. So you could send over some more. <laughs> Wait, how do I see? I have medium wealth. Oh, medium wealth jobs, putting up people. All right, cool. That that makes more sense. Oh, you have some medium wealth workers. Yeah. Yes, I do. Cool. I, I'm missing something. I I don't think I'm seeing. Train map, bus, cool bus, bus. Oh, who's gonna do education? 
oh, you know what? I need to actually put a school in. Um, you, you, you're you actually going industry. You should have like education there, right? Yes, I could do education. Maybe, maybe I can eventually take over the the water too if you need like room or whatever. Because we have to watch out for the room uh, for each city. Because, you know, buildings take a lot of space. They do? Uh, all right. So we got, I got the monies. I don't have the people, but I got the monies. So eventually we will upgrade uh, the roads and get more people and get to the 5,000, get the first upgrade. And right then you can't get an, a module or can you? At the 5,000? You can, right? Yes, you can. Yeah, so that you think transportation is just for the sake of what we're doing? I think if we, when we upgrade, if one of us, whoever does it first, puts down either transportation, the other person puts down utilities, because uh, once your city starts to grow, um, you know you don't really want we're sewage. We're gonna have to treat the poop. Yeah, you don't want the sewage just that running out. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna have to turn that into water, and how to do that? <laughs> yeah. Uh, all right. Well, I think we reached our thirty minutes recording. Oh, we sure have. We sure have. We we got too much into. The, see, this is interesting. That's what I was talking about. Yes, I was <laughs> excited and didn't even think about how long we've been recording. But anyway, uh, uh, I guess I'll do the uh, exit this time. Maybe you could do it the next well, time. Um, that's good. Well, this is it for uh, Sim City Brian and Pablo. Um, be sure to subscribe to both of our channels. Uh, I'll. We'll both have uh, links to our channels below totally. and continue to watch all the episodes. Yeah. Thank you for watching, guys.